Hey, this is journal page 164, lesson 7.5, talking about scales here. Find the missing dimension. Use the scale factor 1 to 8. So each time, that'll be the scale factor 1 to 8. So we'll write, so 1 over 8 equals 168 over x. And we do cross products, and I get x on this side, and 8 times 168, 4, 4, 1, 3. Okay, so 1,344 is the answer, except they're looking for it in feet. And this will give it to us in inches, okay? Because it's a scale factor, which has no units, these units will match. So we just found out that it was 1,000. 344 inches. We'll divide that by 12 to get feet. So 1344 divided by 12. 12 goes into 13 once. 12 goes into 14 once. 12 goes into 24 twice. So the right answer is 112 feet because they wanted it in feet. 112. We'll do this again for, this was number one, for number two. It starts with one to eight because it does say the scale factor is one to eight still. And this time they gave us the actual, which of course goes on the bottom because model over actual. And we're looking for this. When we're done, it'll be in meters. We don't want it in meters, but we'll deal with that in a moment. One times 200 is 200. X times eight is eight X. Divide both sides by 8, and we get x equals, 8 goes into 200 25 times. So that's not exactly what we want because that will give us 25 meters. We want centimeters. Well, there's 100 centimeters in every meter, so we multiply by 100. 25 times 100 equals 2,500 centimeters. 2,500 centimeters. Same kind of problem, number three. One to eight equals something here. They gave us the actual, it goes on bottom, 6.4 feet. Our answer will be in feet. Eight times X is eight X. One times 6.4 is 6.4. Divide by eight, divide by eight, and X equals, eight goes into 6.4 point eight times, because I know point eight times eight is 6.4. So this gives me X equals, um, X feet, which will be 0.8 feet. Well, we don't want feet, we want inches, so we have to multiply that by 12. 12 times 0.8, we get 16, 8, 9, Point eight feet would be nine point six inches. Number four, same kind of problem again. Start off with one over eight equals, and they give us the model, which goes on top, 36 point five inches. Our answer will be in inches, which I'm assuming we don't want. Nope, we want feet. Eight times 36.5. So 40, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, one spot behind the decimal, one spot behind the decimal, 292 inches but we want it in feet, so we'll divide by 12. 
12 goes into 29 twice, which is 24. 12 goes into 52 four times, which is 48. 24 and 4 twelfths, which is the same as 24 and 1 third feet. Number five, the diameter of the moon is 2,160 miles. A model has a scale of one inch to 150 miles. What's the diameter of the model? I probably have enough room to do this one over here. Let's go like this and this and this and that. And they say one inch is 150 miles. And the actual is 2,160 miles. And we're looking for the inches. Well, there's nothing I can multiply this by nicely to get over here, so I guess we'll do cross products and get 150x equals 2,160. Divide by 150. Divide by 150. And 2,160 divided by 150 is 14.4. So the answer is 14.4 inches. A map has a scale of 1 inch to 4 miles. I will need that. 1 inch to 4 miles. You measure three inches between your house and the movie theater. How many miles is it from your house to the movie theater? So three inches equals how many miles? Well, here we just multiplied by three. Here we'll just multiply by three. Four times three is 12 miles. For that last one, it is 17 miles to the mall. How many inches is that on the map? Well, we still use one inch to four miles. They told us it's 17 miles. That's the actual. It goes on bottom, so we're looking for the top. Cross products gives us 4x equals 17. Divide each side by 4, and x equals 4 and 1 fourth inches. Hope that answers all your questions, but if you have any more, ask in class, and we'll see you tomorrow. See you!